Hey guys, story time. So the other day I was at Keystone. I was catching some bass, a striped stri bass, stripers. And uh, I was just catching and releasing. Uh, I wasn't planning to keep or harvest any fish that day. But the guy next to me wanted one of my fish. So I was like, yeah, sure. So I just, I gave him one of my fish. Um, and re I released the rest, but I kept, I kept fishing. And the next thing he knew, he throws the carcass back into the water. Which is totally legal here in Oklahoma. You could do that. It's supposedly, it helps feed the other fish or something like that. But the dude threw away the head and the tail. I mean, he just literally just laid the sides and threw everything back in. And uh, I wasn't mad or anything, but it made me regret giving this guy the fish because I was like, dude's missing out on like the best eating part of the fish. The head and the tail is like my dad's favorite part of a, a big size striped bass. So, uh, made me kind of regret. I could have, like, given my dad a, a nice striper, or I could have basically released the fish back to make more stripers for us. So, this video right here is for the guys that just don't eat the head and their tail. From when I harvest the fish, uh, we eat the head, tail, and body. Like, be, the only thing we don't eat is, like, the guts and, you know, gills on the gills and all that stuff, but yeah, we clean the fish and we eat the whole thing. Uh, so here's the video of Connery dissecting basically and eating a head to show you guys where all the good meats are. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hey, if you guys haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. All right, we'll eat the head too. Oh, look at that. All right. The moment we've all been waiting for. How do you eat the head? The striper head. I'm probably singling myself out as a weirdo, but I don't care. This piece right here has got, like I said, it's like a scallop or something. For Beth. After you eat that. The cheek. Mm -hmm, the cheek meat. After you eat that. Cheek meat. There's a lot of like fatty like uh, meats around the uh, the lips. All you gotta do is just literally pull the lips off the face of the striper, and look at all this. This is all edible meat right here too. This is just like it's like belly meat. That's what I call it. But it's all extra good too. It's all edible. Yeah, this sauce is awesome, dude. Mm. Yeah, get, uh, bring stuff to work. Let's oh, chop. I'm gonna bring them to work tomorrow yeah. for sure. Let Chow try some. Mm -hmm. I'm eating people, yo. Yeah. Give me a thumbs up right now. Yeah, I'll go some. You know, you know what's up. I'm eating strapper heads. Mmm. Mmm. It's a good deal. Mmm. That's the deal right there. Alright. All right, so that's how you eat the striper head. The top lip, there's not much there, but like the bottom jaw, mm, same thing. A lot of like fatty meats. It's like it's like dark meat for chicken, you know. This is all dark meat, you can say. That's the tongue. There's nothing on the tongue. And then this is like all the gills, the gill plate and stuff. Uh, a lot of little things here. If you boil this, is actually a lot better. But when you, when you uh, do, what we just did where you grill it. All the meats tend to like fall off. That's done. Okay. The eyeballs. I don't eat it. I just suck the stuff around it. All right. Good with that. That's the eyeball. And once again, there's a lot of like cheese in here. Mm. Tastes like bacon almost. The other side. Mm. You can make a video how to eat striper heads, dude. <laughs> so good. Let's turn this into a video. <laughs> How, do you How do you strap our heads? <laughs> How do you strap our heads? Mmm.
this is part two. First, watch part one. That's right. And show you guys how we cook this. It's like an onion. You just keep peeling it back. And you get more and more meat out of it. You know? Mmm. It's like, look, a subscriber already. <laughs> okay. That's done. Alright, so I've eaten through half the hair already. I'm already through to the other side. Mm. You know, we're random bones in here too. Be careful what you're eating. Mm. That's the deal right there. Skin. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe the dog wants them too. <laughs> oh, top of the head. Top of the head is where actually all the meats are at. A lot of the regular looking meat. Top of the head. Is that top of the head? That's like the forehead. Peel that back and this is all meat right here too. So, this is something your fillet is not going to get. It's almost a different tasting meat. Mmm. What's the deal? Mm. Need some rice? <laughs> yes. Sticky purple rice. Sticky purple rice. It is rice New Year's the season, you know? Yeah. That's what Sticky purple rice would go rice. like perfect mm. with this. Thumbs up. Sticky purple rice? Mm. Good deal. Yep. That's not good, guys. Okay, where's the other one? Let's cook that one too. All oh, this meat just falls off. Let's go. Mm. Alright, I'm done. I can't eat them all. Look at my bones, man. That's how you know it's good. See a lot of TV shows you watch them, they don't they don't reveal their bones. They don't they might take one bite and they just call it good. This is how you know there's a whole skull of bones right here. Mm. See you guys on the next one. Hey everybody, thanks for watching, but stop freeloading. We need you guys to hit the subscribe button. The like button and the bell and be sure to follow us on instagram and facebook and we'll see you guys on the next one